Hi everyone, Merry Christmas if you're celebrating. I hope you're having a wonderful festive season with your friends, with your loved ones. Today I will be filming my annual What I Got For Christmas but I will also be unboxing my purchases from Paris so this will be What I Got For Christmas slash What I Got From Paris plus a Chanel 23C cruise collection unboxing because I still haven't filmed my cruise unboxings. Let's get straight into this unboxing because I have quite a few pieces to show you. Let's go. All right, let's kick this off with a very special gift that I received from Chanel. This is a very special gift that I received from my essay, from the manager, the boutique I shop from, and I was so, so surprised. I couldn't believe it when I received this little package. So I received this really amazing card. I will insert a class up. And then what's inside really surprised me. I received this two days ago. So we have this stunning Christmas packaging with the pearl. I unboxed it the other day and I was so shocked. I could not believe it. It is the most special pair of earrings. And guys, they're little shells. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed with shells. I have shell plates in my kitchen. When I was little, I used to collect shells from the beach. And yeah, I have a thing for shells. So when I saw these earrings, I was honestly speechless. This is the best gift for me <laughs> because you guys know how much I love Chanel costume jewelry, especially their earrings. So I wear them a lot. So I actually have already worn these and they look so cute on. Before I continue with the unboxing, I have a little surprise giveaway for you guys. So Samorga and I decided to give one of you an insert. You guys know I absolutely love using Samorga inserts inside my beautiful handbags. And I always recommend you guys try them out as well. They are really amazing. They are made of felt and they protect the insides of your bags so they don't only keep your bags organized but they also help to maintain the shape of your bag while you are using it and when you store it especially when it comes to softer bags these Samorga inserts are a must-have like the Chanel 19, Chanel 22 travel bags like the Louis Vuitton Kipos they even have inserts for makeup vanities and they're honestly so so useful because you guys know now, makeup bags can get quite a dirty foundation sleek so these inserts are machine washable they're very very lightweight they don't take up more space they also offer different felt thickness they also have a variety of different colors so you can either pick a matching color or a pop of color Samorga will always be my number one for bag inserts they always try to improve their designs and they have bag inserts for literally every single style you can think of or the new bag releases they actually purchase the bags and you can follow them on Instagram for some eye candy as well. They also sell accessories for the bags like chains. So definitely, definitely check them out. They are currently running their holiday sale. So they have amazing promotion. I will make sure I link everything down below. And if you guys want to win an insert of your choice, just leave me a comment. And again, I will randomly select the winner from the comment section. Make sure you follow me and Samorga on Instagram because that's where I will announce the winner in a week time. So you have a week to enter the giveaway. I will make sure I leave all the details again down below in the comments. I will pin it as a comment, but also do check out the description box. So next I'll continue with my purchases from the cruise collection. I'll just do all the Chanel first and then the rest later. Uh, but let me show you, this is the first item that I got. It comes in this box. And then inside we have a pair of sunglasses and these are so special, even the case is really special. Can you guys see it has the crystal CC? So these will actually match my outfit because they're these very special sunglasses with pearls on the top <laughs> so they are so so amazing you guys know pearls are so signature for chanel everything with pearls sells out so quick i saw these online actually initially but 
I didn't really pay that much attention because I was like, okay, this shape is not going to suit me. I loved the look of them, but I was like, nope, this shape of sunglasses won't suit me at all. And then I went to the boutique, I saw these, I was actually after another pair of sunglasses, but I saw these and I was like, oh, I saw these online. They look really cool. Let me try them on at least. I can see if they look really funny on me. I tried them on and actually they look sick. They look so amazing on, but you have to wear them lower on your nose. Next, we have a more Chanel. So in here I have a few items. Let me show you what's in this box. I wasn't planning on getting this, but then I saw it and I was like, yep, I want it. It looks amazing. So in here we have a scarf. Here it is. It is black and white. And you guys know the cruise collection was inspired by Monaco, by the Formula One, the tennis. And I saw this. It was with the ready to wear and I saw it hanging on a little hanger between the clouds. It instantly caught my eye. It's just very simple, black and white, very classic design, very, again, signature Chanel colors. And I thought it looked so elegant, although it had the logos everywhere. I still think with a very plain outfit. And again, that day I was wearing a full black outfit. I thought this will look amazing just tied around the neck. I was also planning my Paris trip. I knew I was traveling in a couple of days and I was like, yep, this scarf will be perfect in Paris with my Paris outfit. So I got it and it is so, so amazing. I have shown you in my previous videos how I wear these scarves as a top in the summer. You can wear them with blazers. All right, next we have some more Chanel and you can probably tell by the size of the box What's in here? Yep, it's another pair of sunglasses. So let me show you. So in here we have this stunning pair of white sunglasses. Wait for it. With pearls. <laughs> oh my god, these guys are my first pair of white sunglasses. I do not have a single pair of white sunglasses and I've been on the hunt a white frame sunglasses for so long and I missed on one pair from Chanel last summer actually no it wasn't last summer it was the summer before when I saw these I jumped on them and these actually I ordered online they sent me one of the exclusive perfumes uh, with these sunglasses so I actually love ordering you can order sunglasses from Chanel online you can only order sunglasses and makeup you can't order any of the other uh, fashion pieces unfortunately you can't order shoes or bags but sunglasses makeup fragrances you can and they always send you little freebies so I love that and the last from Chanel can you guys guess what's in this box another pair of sunglasses but this was actually the only item that I was after from this collection these sunglasses I had to go to all the boutiques in London. These come again in a slightly different case with this red logo. I knew these sunglasses will be a hot seller. I really didn't want to miss on them. So these, they advertised on their campaign with uh, Lily Rose Depp. And I saw them on her. I absolutely fell in love with these sunglasses. These are so, so lightweight, they're oversized. I loved the champagne gold bit on the top with the Chanel logos. And there are two little logos on the side on the lens as well. As soon as I saw these, I knew I wanted them and I was gonna wear them a lot because I have a very similar pair from Dior that I don't take off. I constantly wear my Dior pair of sunglasses and I thought these are very similar style. The color of the lens is the exact same color. They will work well with my wardrobe as well. So I'm really glad I found them and they were the last pair. I think they restocked. So if you like the look of them, definitely go and order ASAP because I'm sure they will sell out again. Okay, are you guys ready for my Paris purchases? This is the most exciting one. If you haven't watched my recent Paris shopping vlog, definitely check it out. I'll make sure I link it above. So I got a little something something from Van Cleef and I can't wait to show you. So it comes in this box. 
they gave me a little travel pouch and inside I have my certificates. I bought this from Gallery Lafayette and I was actually so surprised that they have stock because the stock in London currently is really really poor. Everything sells out during the holidays because people buy these as gifts. So inside we have this stunning Van Cleef green box. So if you've watched my Paris vlog, you probably have an idea what I ended up getting. I got... Ta-da! <laughs> I got this stunning black onyx Van Cleef necklace in yellow gold. I really want it since last year. I actually tried this on last year, but I didn't get it because I ended up buying my Cartier Pave ring. I also got the hammered gold Van Cleef bracelet. So I really wanted to get the <laughs> necklace and the matching earrings so I can have the full set to match with my bracelet. Unfortunately, they didn't have the vintage size earrings. They were sold out everywhere. But honestly, I was so happy. I couldn't even believe they had the necklace because as I said, these pieces sell out so quick. They did have the sweet size Alhambra Black Onyx um, earrings. They're very, very cute. Also, these are very hard to get, especially here in the UK. So I'm happy that I managed to tick off at least one of the pieces that I wanted this Christmas. Also, if you have watched the vlog already, you know that I tried on the diamond Van Cleef necklace. That one has been on my wish list again for quite some time and I was very, very tempted, especially with the tax that you get uh, from these when you shop from Paris, you can get a tax refund. And I already spoiled myself so much this Christmas, so I thought I'll just leave it maybe for a more special occasion, like my birthday maybe next year, so who knows, maybe I'll be getting it for my birthday. So while I was in Paris, I managed to tick off another wish list item. And you can probably guess what it is. So I got myself a pair of shoes from Laura Piana. And by the way, look at the Christmas bags. They're so cute with these little uh, snowflake charms. So the shoes come in these test bags and I did not ask for a box. I said no boxes because I didn't have space in my suitcase. It was full to the brim. So inside we have... Guys, you will die. These are the cutest pair of Chuka boots. These are called the Chuka Open Walk uh, shoes or boots. Um, and I really love them, especially in this color. They look so adorable. This is the style with the beaver fur. These, honestly, they are very pricey. I hesitated for the longest time if I should buy them or not. But <laughs> guys, my feet during the winter months are constantly cold <laughs> and I really wanted a pair of super warm shoes so I went to try them on I have actually already worn them I can report back and say they are first of all extremely comfortable it's definitely one of those if you know you know brands <laughs> they are very understated although many people would probably recognize the brand because they are all over Instagram and social media. So I know these are quite popular now on social media. Um, they are the hype right now. Everyone buys Laura Piano shoes. But I understand why they not only look amazing, they look so elegant, they really elongate your legs. The design is very simple, but they look very stylish even, I would say. Um, they go with everything as well. And yes, I have heard from so many people that these are really comfortable, but until you try them on, you cannot understand how comfortable they actually are. It's like walking on clouds. These are hands down my most comfortable shoes I own. And I know I've said that for some of my other pairs of shoes, some of the sneakers that I own, but honestly, these you cannot compare with another pair of shoes. So I highly recommend these if you are after a very, very comfortable pair of shoes. Also, if you're looking for a very warm pair of shoes, these are the ones. As I said, these were quite pricey, but also they had 13% um, tax return. So I saved up quite a bit and I paid in euros. So they were also a bit cheaper. So these were my Paris purchases. Before I show you the rest of the London purchases. I actually wanted to mention something else that I bought for my Paris trip. I finally got myself a Remoa 
luggage and guys i'm so happy i have been wanting one of these suitcases for about two years but to be honest i decided not to get it before just because of all the lockdowns i wasn't traveling that much so i thought finally now that the world is open again and we can travel and i'm planning to travel again uh, next year i thought it's the perfect time to finally get myself a Remora luggage and this is the one I'll insert some clips this is the one that I decided to get I really I was after a very specific color but I didn't realize it was a limited edition color it was the uh, I think it's called the bamboo green but it was impossible to find I tried everywhere it was already sold out everywhere so they were actually expecting to get the new season colors so every year they release limited edition colors and this year they have like a dark green and raspberry the raspberry by the way is chef's kiss it's so lovely um, so definitely check them out highly highly recommend them they are so easy to roll and i decided to get the I think it's called the trunk style and this is the essential line so it's a bit lighter but it's very very durable so yeah i traveled with that suitcase to paris and it fits so much uh, they have the standard size but i really loved the look of this one it's a bit more compact um, as well so it's not as wide and it fits a ton because it is quite deep so loving it <laughs> Next I'll show you another wishlist item from Dior. This has been on my wishlist for I believe two years again and if you've watched my Paris vlogs I think some of you already spotted this um, in my Paris vlog and on my Instagram finally got the Dior coat. Guys, this is the most amazing coat that I own <laughs> and I have many coats, okay? I'm obsessed with outwear and you guys know how many coats I have but this one, honestly, I have already worn so much since I got it and I got it maybe last month, I would say. It kept me warm during the minus temperatures. It was so cold in London last week and I wore this coat, I wrapped up with a scarf and it kept me really, really warm. Um, so this one is reversible. You can wear it on the monogram side, but I would never, you would never see me wearing it. Um, well, never say never, but I doubt I would ever uh, wear it on the monogram side just because it's a bit too loud. And I love the just a very subtle pop of monogram when you wear it you can see the lining especially when you wear it open you can see the lining inside i love to just roll up the sleeves so you can see the touch of monogram i want to know how many of you actually remember when i spoke about this coat when i showed it on my channel i think i showed it in a vlog and then i kept talking about it i mentioned it in one of my wish lists so i would love to hear in the comments how many of you actually remember me talking about this coat and wanting it so badly. So this coat I actually ended up getting from Papillon Kia. I have a vlog, I'll make sure I link it above. I went to visit their pop-up and that's where I got my Dior, my newest Lady Dior from. I got the Lady Dior first and then I couldn't stop thinking about this so I ended up getting the coat from Papillon Kia as well and I actually ended up saving a bit more than a thousand pounds and this card was brand new with tags so super happy with this one and last but definitely not least two more pairs of shoes from Laura Piana you guys know when I love something I buy multiples and I couldn't stop browsing the website after I came back from Paris after I tried on the shoes and I saw how comfortable they were I wanted to buy more so let me start with this box and show you what I got I ordered these online by the way the packaging in the boxes are so lovely they're so luxurious and yeah I love the ribbon with the little bow at the end like the little wooden bow at the end I'm not sure if that's just for Christmas now or if it's like one of their signature things i just started getting into laura piana and i'm loving everything not only the shoes but the ready to wear is amazing as well so let me show you what i ordered online and in here we have 
another really cute pair of the Chuka style boots. I love these. These are in the navy color. I know they look black, they are navy. You can definitely see them in daylight. Again, I have actually already worn them. I filmed them before I started wearing them because I wanted to film them brand new. So I do have some clips um, to insert, you can see. Again, this color goes with everything. I love navy blue to me. Navy blue is such a neutral color. It also works really, really well with my wardrobe and it also matches my new Dior coat. So I'm very happy. So these were actually less than half the price of the other style. Let me explain why. These Truca boots, uh, with sheep fur. So the other ones were beaver, they're really really warm, they feel more luxurious. These, they look the same but the fur is actually sheep and it is a bit more rough. It does keep my feet warm again, they are very warm and cozy inside but the other ones feel definitely a bit more luxurious. The fur is so much softer, so I know they're a lot more pricier, but just wanted to show you they do have a cheaper option if you want to try them out first before going for the more expensive ones. These were just under £900 as far as I remember, and yeah, as I said, they come in so many different colours. They restock constantly because these sell out so fast, so definitely keep an eye out on the website. I got different sizes in both of them, so the white pair is in 38 and a half. They run true to size, but I'm between sizes. If you are a true 38, get 38. If you are between sizes, like me, I have the white pair in 38 and a half, these in 38, and they both fit fine. These fit a bit more snug, the other ones are a bit more roomy, but the 38 in the other pair was sold out, so that's why I got a 38 and a half, but they both fit fine and they're super comfortable, so highly, highly recommend them. And the last pair, these are slightly different, they're not exactly the same. Just wait until you see the colour. So I have a little booklet and... So these are brand new, I haven't worn these yet, and they are the open walks again in this stunning it tube colour. <laughs> okay, so this colour is not called it tube, this I believe was called koala, koala brown as far as I remember. And they should be still available online, hopefully they are not sold out, but when I saw this colour online I was like, this? looks exactly like the Hermes tube and I've been actually searching for a matching colour for my baby Birkin so when I saw these I ordered them. This is the plain style without the fur so these will be great for the transitional period in the autumn, also in the spring so super excited to wear them. They are so fresh, they smell amazing <laughs> so you guys know they are suede the soles are so fresh and of course i will bring my baby birkin so you can see how nicely they match they are very very close color so they will be amazing styled together cannot wait to wear them so these are the third and last pair of laura piano shoes and i'm obsessed with this color i <laughs> seem to be buying everything in a tube <laughs> lately so yeah, love them, cannot wait to wear them because they're still brand new. Okay guys, that's all. I hope you enjoyed my what I got for Christmas video slash what I got from Paris slash what I got from Chanel Cruise. <laughs> Thank you so, so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section. I would absolutely love to hear what you guys got for Christmas. I will make sure I link everything in the description box and also don't forget about the Samorga giveaway. So just leave me a comment that you would like to win an organizer and I will select the winner on my Instagram. So make sure you follow me and Samorga on Instagram as well. Thank you so, so much for watching again. I hope you're all having a wonderful festive season. Bye guys!